that's not a sign to like i don't know skedaddle i don't know what is this like he gonna put some fists on you i'm I, stop playing with me like he look like them types he punch holes in the wall all that like if he's saying it believe it This is just a quick story of somehow I got played in my face. So basically I was in a group chat. It was a small group chat of people I know IRL. My friend, let's call her Moni, had followed on IG. And one day she was mutuals of 17 people. She posted on her story, who wanna be added to a group chat? So I hearted her story because I was bored. And this can be a small pop out summer group chat. And I see people who I know. So immediately I'm comfortable in the group chat. The group chat will get dry sometimes and we'll send reels or we'll bully each other. But I had peeped two people I liked that go by Marcus and LJ. LJ was somebody I peeped at first and we were talking on the phone. But that's when I was out of town in Mississippi. But I could tell that he wasn't interested in me so I backed off. Then I went to Marcus. So I kept dropping hints in the group chat that I like someone. They kept saying, who is it? And I would never say. But one time the situation happened and then I got mad. I got mad at, I called him to vent. <laughs> I called him to vent about the situation. I can't remember what it was. Then I asked him, do you want to know who I like? And he said, yeah, cause I've been wanting this for a little minute. So I said it was him. First red flag, how fast we got started into this relationship. We didn't know anything about each other. Sounds like an IMV relationship. Sound like a Roblox relationship. Sound like literally any internet relationship. Like, come on, bro. They said that was a red flag because they got started in a relationship very quickly and they didn't know anything about, about each other. Now, this is the second red flag in a relationship. So basically he didn't want to want to be posted at all, which made me feel a type of way. But I was like, fuck it, I guess it's cool. So we was on the phone all the time. I mean, all the time, we would be on the phone or while I'm at the store and everything. So recently I moved like a month ago, a small city in New Orleans, Louisiana. Are you in Louisiana? So he lived two minutes away from me. It would be a 15 minute walk. Oh, okay. So he lives really close to you now. So I would sneak him in and he would unlock the gate at 11 30 p.m every night i was there while my dad and my stepmom would be asleep so every time i would go by my dad i would sneak him in which i regret because i never been this stupid for a boy so then an incident happened in our relationship people kept saying i was lying about my age i'm 16 going on 17 and he's 17 going on 18 and people kept saying i was 14 i had to show them my school id prior to that we kept it on the low i just couldn't even post him as much as i wanted to we would make tiktok he would let me post him on an occasion even though he didn't want to be posted at all we would make tiktok <laughs> it says so basically one day moni made a post about her being pregnant moni the friend right and it was a big situation one of her friends basically tried to jump me and my friend when we talked about it in a group chat marcus was on moni's side of the argument which really made me upset but i didn't say anything about it so i talked to marcus about it and we got over it but i was upset moni made a i message group chat with everyone from the group chat on IG who had her name in her mouth and a bunch of stuff. So I admitted I had said something first about her being fake pregnant and how it was embarrassing. Yo, what? Fake pregnant? It says, so me and her started beefing on Snapchat going back and forth. He texted me saying that y'all arguing is funny, but you, you, <laughs> but you, you need to stop because you just made it worse. So I left it alone. But the same accusations that I said before about me lying about my age had made us get into another argument. So I texted a girl who was bucking up his head. I never heard of bucking up his head. Is that a thing? Like hyping up? They mean hyping up? <laughs> hyping his head up? That bucking up. <laughs> <laughs> so basically I confronted Ari stop talking about our relationship or whatever so she was like I understand or whatever and we came to an agreement but keep in mind for further in the story so I confronted him telling him that he needs to stop telling listening to people and holding these allegations to my name didn't y'all link up in real life why does he not believe you is he not believe you or something does he did he not believe that you were 16 and y'all linked up in real life and you were sneaking him in I'm a little confused like how does he not believe that you 16 and y'all talked in real life and you showed him your school ID you shouldn't even have to like like how a conversation with him about that stop listening to people and holding the allegations to my name so normally i would go to my best friend i would tell her everything that was going on and she would text him and check him he apologized to me for believing them why did you like is this is he slow ask for my passwords and my snap on ig and i didn't give it to him and he was like okay so we stopped talking for a day and then he texted me saying that i think i like going a day without texting you i missed the old us or whatever and i fed into it so he, we planned for him to come over and i go back down there because i'm with my mom then those plans get shattered because the same night he gets on the phone with Ari, he vents about our problems. Now me and Ari used to be close, but we just lost contact. So guess what he does? He falls asleep on the phone with her and she posts him with hearts on Snapchat. What? <laughs> Damn, that's actually kind of messy. So basically your friend that you don't talk to no more. Is this a situation ship? What the hell is this? Is this your boyfriend? Is them or your boyfriend? Goes to talk to your ex-best friend vents to her and then falls asleep on the phone with her and then she posts him with hearts on snapchat you know how fast my heart would drop to my damn ass if i seen that 
you know how long I would not eat? I don't know, bro. That's actually kind of, that's actually kind of fucked up. I just get in my feelings. I'm not really crying. I'm just disappointed because why would you do something like this? I texted him a paragraph before he woke up and we started arguing. My best friend and my ex gets involved. So I tell them and my best friend texting him and confronting him. And my ex just ready to fight him because me and my ex best friends are now really close. Wait, your best friend is a boy? Where did I miss that at? Am I just not reading right? So me and him are arguing and going back and forth. And we, we just stopped talking. He texted me saying, I'll leave you alone. And I said, please. Please do. So I posted something shady on Snap and he <laughs> and he still has me at it. And he replied to it saying, bro, I said what's wrong. And he said nothing, bro. And I guess it was still in his feels. If you the messages has more details, but please when you get a chance on Discord, call me so I can explain better. You already typed all this, bro. You might as well just said that in the beginning. Yo, bro, just 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 let's just talk in Discord. Like if you just said that, then I wouldn't even read that. I wouldn't even read that. We already read it. We might as well read the messages. Cause what's the point? Let's bring it all together. Anyway, it says, I know you lying. You was doing some sneaky shit too. You sent a whole arch pic to another when we first got together. The was like, I f with it, ma. What? Then you said something along the lines, I think I'm crushing on D. So you was doing shit too? I'm like, who Who are these messages to? Is this is this him messaging you? So neither of y'all are innocent. Not SCT being boppy honest. Says, so don't even act all hurt and shit like you wasn't doing sneaky shit too. Don't act like it was special to you because I went through your archives every month and it was a different you post so don't even act like i was doing anything special to you why would you send us this <laughs> like i ain't gonna lie bro like like I, I get it like i guess you're talking about the relationship da, da, da. it was me that was sending this in i would have never sent this like why would you send him reading you like why would you send him saying things that you did he damn near exposing you what's going on then you were still friends with you used to fuck with what is happening what that <laughs> and that's where you went wrong the f you you going through my account for that's my account. I control. Because you know, I ask because my account. First of Nick. First of Nick is my partner. I've been knowing him for two years now. In 2022, we used to talk about you, but we ain't work, so we became cool. Then D a troll. That was a whole group chat troll. That's why I said that. Bitch, she has hearts by your shit. The fuck? <laughs> yeah, I don't know why this is funny, bro. It was something we were supposed to be talking it out, and you were fing flunky because you on the phone with the same that was bucking up to you, bucking up your head, bucking up to head. I never heard of this term, bucking up head. Looking f***ing dumb. Like, if you want to mess with her, go ahead. And yeah, I can be butt her because you were supposed to be my The fuck? I'm supposed to be waiting on you, you to call or something to text me, but nope, you, you want to sit on the phone with somebody. You know we got problems right now. We can still talk about it. Why do you still want to talk about it? What's going on, bro? Why y'all, I feel like, I feel like some of y'all just like toxic relationships. Some of y'all just like toxicness. That's what it's giving. Cause like, y'all be sending me whole last paragraphs. Damn super, I'm going through this and that. And even though it's not confessions at all, and please do not confess. When y'all be telling me stories about y'all relationships, that's toxic as hell. Like actually bad. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like a little bit of toxic is okay. I mean, I feel like that's normal though. Like you gonna argue, you're gonna fight, you're gonna have dysfunction. Like you're two different human beings. That's going to happen. I'm saying like when they be going crazy, like talking about, yeah, they cheated and this and that and they be taking them back. And it's like, what? What you want me to, and they be like super advice? Advice? What you want me to say? What do you want me to say, bro? You think I'm about to tell you to stay? No. Why would I tell you to stay? That shit crazy, bro. We want to see you react to 20 v one videos, bro. Then send them in the Discord, then, bro. In the hub, hashtag hub. I promise. Come on, send them. I don't know which ones to react to. You know how many 20 v one videos there are? Send me a specific one. I got you. So they said you gonna need to show me some type of proof of your age, cause I don't know. At this point, bro. Like what? Wasn't y'all already linking up? I don't understand this, bro. You did some shit I would hate you for, it, but we ain't gonna get on that. We can still be cool. Okay, okay, bro. How the f you want me to respond? You just told me you was fucking with somebody else in my face. I, exactly. I to everything. I'm gonna just leave you alone. Please do. I never seen this reaction before. Is this some iOS 17, 18 shit? Like, is my shit not updated? Cause what? When did when the when the heart turned pink like this? I thought the heart was like red and 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 dry. Like somebody come get they chop. <laughs> um so that's him <laughs> um i don't give a fuck about none of that troll shit you was still saying it you didn't tell me shit or none you still sent the arch pick to another nigga the second day we started talking i don't care about none of that shit or whatever oh well you gonna have to suck it up because i had to suck up the fact that you was on the phone with a fee and fell asleep on the phone with her suck it up i'm gonna jump up and, ki and drop kick the fuck out you because what you mean suck it up oh you're getting aggressive that's not a sign to like I don't know, skedaddle. I don't know what is this. Like he gonna put some fists on you. I'm. I, I hate to be one of them people, but he like he put fists on. 
I ain't gonna lie. Stop playing with me. Like he looked like them types. He punched holes in the wall, all that. Like I just, I just, if he's saying it, believe it. <laughs> Not her having the receipts for the fake pregnancy. <laughs> what where are these reactions thumbs up thumbs down ha ha like i ain't never seen this shit that's an update well seems like we got everything we needed huh